Hello, and welcome to this clip looking at branching and its effects on boiling point in organic compounds. We're going to use a five mark on structure question walkthrough to illustrate these ideas. So it gives you three um, compounds, A, B, and C. You can clearly see there's different skeletal formulae. And it says, use the structures to explain what is meant by the term structural isomer. So if we go back to our definition of structural isomer, it's same molecular formula and different structural formulae. So each of those has a molecular formula of C5H12, and you can see obviously that means it's the same. But if we do the structural formula in purple, you can see that they're also different. This pays attention to the fact that there's more branching as you go further down. You'll also see that the boiling point goes down, so something's affecting it. So they want you to explain the trend in the boiling points shown by the three compounds. So the increase in branching uh, means fewer surface contact points per London forces, which in turn means fewer or weaker London forces. And this affects the boiling point because there's less energy needed to overcome the London forces in the first place, so the boiling point goes down. Okay, thanks for listening. I hope this has been useful. Until next time, see you soon.